Johnson. Today is Tuesday, April 30th, 2019. I'm your anchor, Sophie. And I'm your anchor, Madison. And please stand and join us for the pledges and the moment of silence. Today's artwork was created by Amaris in second grade. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for the Texas Pledge. I'll honor the, the Texas, Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to thee, Texas, one state, under God, one and indivisible. And now for the moment of... Well, let's take a look at the weather for today. Right now, it's 75 degrees and overcast. We got a high temperature of 85 degrees today with a 30% chance of rain. It looks like we're going to get a bunch of rain tomorrow and Friday. But by Sunday, we should, we should, we should start to dry out again. It's definitely spring. And, and now for our lunch choices. Choice one, a chicken mashed potato bowl. Choice two, a, a barbecue chicken and cheddar flatbread. Choice three, a sun butter and jelly sandwich. Choice four, an all-American salad bar. Today is the last day in April, which means you need to turn in your poetry bingo cards into the library. Don't forget about all the pickles and popcorn for sale. And really, and really don't forget about the latest turn of the beat shirts. PTA is selling latest turn of the beat shirts for $5. Let's take a look at this video to learn what this week's Tuesday tech tip is. Well, that's all we got for you from the JOJ TV News Desk. Today's news is brought to you by broadcast team number 11. Sophie, Liam, and Madison. And remember, Trailblazers, be, be safe, be respectful, be responsible, and have an Top Notch Tuesday. Bye. Bye. Hi, I'm Grace, and this is Macy from Alice in Wonderland. Let's check up and see how the play is going. Welcome, Macy. Hi, I'm Macy from Alice in Wonderland, and I'm the Alice in the play. So, I've had to explain this to a lot of people, but the reason that we have two Alices is um, because Alice alone has 292 lines, so I don't want to have to memorize 292 lines because I'm already falling a little bit short of my own lines. Uh, there are three fifth graders that I know of that are in the play. There's a ton of uh, third graders and uh, some fourth graders, so yeah. That's a lot of lines. I bet y'all are going to enjoy watching it next Thursday. That's right, next Thursday. Make sure not to interrupt your neighbors and not take pictures during it. Until then, bye.